Hello ladies and gents, I'm Anna Diffin and this is Early Access Factorio version 0.12. So, in this episode I actually want to try and get some robots going. Um, have the batteries here. A lot of batteries here actually, so let's grab some. Uh, Rover ports and stuff, so the frames require electric engines. I have built the electric engine down here somewhere. Yep, so it's still producing nice and slowly. Got lubricant in there. And all this. So can actually start making robot frames. But I do need to get a robot port first, which uses so much materials. Let's get some gear wheels though. Get some gear wheels out of the way. And advanced, so that's some red circuits. Have I got any red circuits up here? Ooh, I'm running low on the plastic. So let's go grab some more from my stuff up here. So that's one thing I can do. I've got underground belt, I do. I can't quite fit through. That's really annoying. How about a long arm inserter It's going to bring the plastic back down. Where do I need it, though? Ooh, that. Okay, the accumulator's all activating at the time. Looks really pretty. Still, I am doing okay with the plastic, I just want to try and get it automated. Wow, look at it all. Look at this, uh, the size of this thing. So much empty space. to engage the enemy. Always low on the iron plates. Always. So I'm going to put a laser here. 
once it's built. Blaze will have a bit of a longer range. And that should be able to hit things over here a bit easier. Yep, finish building the laser. Any time now. That'll take a long time to build. So your energy consumption, 3.4 megawatts when they're firing. Wow. Okay, move, run up all this belt. Railway track. Ah, so it does use stone. Iron is doing well. Grab some steel plate. And the inventory is getting full of plastic. So now I'm low on wire again. Grab the wire from here. So I want wire. Huh. So we could do with a supply of green circuits again. Good into it damage. Fantastic. Let's still upgrade bullet damage since I am still using a bullets a fair amount. But yes, the gun turrets are a bit more powerful now, I guess. Oh, didn't the gun turret? I thought the gun turret damage would help with the um, lasers, but maybe it's because they. Yeah, maybe, hang on, are they? Oh, they're gun turrets, not just turrets. Ah, laser turrets. Right, got you. Yes, yeah, so that's improved them. That's right killing field, isn't it? Let's put a laser up here as well. This way, I now need some more underground belts. Found here. Then where's this in the ground belt gone? There we go. Take that again. Fast transport belt. Do you want to have more transport belts? Just 
grab all that iron. Excellent, so this is now coming along here, along here. Plastic's now coming down here. So it's not quite there yet. Uh, where is the chest I just picked up? Seriously, where's it gone? There it is. Cable. Excellent. That's now working as I'd like it to. Okay, so we've got some biters attacking up here. You've got used many of the large poles. No, it's because I've got quite a few. Put the accumulators down. Laser here. Okay, so it's I'm now full of light oil. Actually, I can crack now, can't I? Should be going into that oil. Oh, heck. thing. I need a new storage tank to get this heavy oil out. It up. Uh, so hang on. It's like, oh, good and proper. Let's build a small pump. If you have messed this up properly here. Well, let's put the refinery down where I need it. This goes here. Now, underground pipe. So 
there. So now I have water. Okay, now the chemical plant, where is that? That you... You can still make sulfur. So the small pump I'm just getting the heavy oil out here to start with. Should now be able to empty that using this pump. Okay, good. The pump's working. Well, then need to. We just need to sort this out so I can you actually can crack this down. need more red circuits. Logistic slots are handy. Let's get let's get the speed modules going though. What's our grid looking like now? So it's all my all my manufacturers are doing a lot. Just put all the plastic all the plastic in there. Those are engaging, engaging aliens. Let's get to that turret. These turrets are also fairly redundant now. I find them scattered around all over. And this has still got heavy oil in it. This should now be blocked of oil. Can't tell if it's heavy oil or light oil which is blocking it. Okay, pull it out these storage tanks. Pull it all out. That's basically fine. So 
the heavy oil is now out. We need to do the same with the light oil. Do still need this here. Okay, and now a similar thing over here. Let's get a small electric pump. And now I've got several storage tanks. Okay then. Speed modules are done. They're very useful. Armor crafting, and I can start working on all of that stuff. Okay, oil is being evacuated out of here. Heavy oil is now causing the blockage. Brilliant. That's kind of sort of what I was aiming for. Build a rover port. You can build a rover port. Can I build any logistics bots yet? I can build some logistics bots. Let's just get all that going. Do the speed modules in the hair. Everything's doing efficiency. You it should be a laser. Now I've got working on here, making some, making the Robo port. Cool. the gun there. Okay, where am I going to go with all this? Hey, just look at look at all these alien look at all the biter nests. Wow. Just running along with all this. Right, this looks like it's now got access outside.
Yeah, I'm just gonna pave over everything. Pretty sure this actually makes it less, you know, work less for um, absorbing uh, pollution, but quite honestly, I'm getting a lot of pollution. I'm producing a lot of pollution anyway. as well. So, a load of biters do come along here. And so I need electrical circuits to deal with that. Provider chest, request chest. This is a provider chest. Let's get a load more of those actually. Again, low on electrical on the circuits. Some more of these and more logistics robots, I think. Ooh, modular armor. Hmm. Personal robot port is what I'm really after now. The doubling the effectiveness of the logistics robots is amazing. Where's my rover port? Here it is. Right then. So logistics is the red area, the orange area, and the construction is the green area. Some construction bots. Okay, so I need water to this cracking.
my underground pipe. Just crack everything down into petroleum gas. Hmm. It's annoying that you have to get the water in this side. I would kind of like the water on that side because it would have made thing life a lot easier. So didn't plan this very well. Um, right. Belt maneuvering. Got it. That, then I can move this down one more. Where did I put it? Not that one. This one. Chemical plant. Pipe. I need more pipe. So let's build more. really help actually that doesn't really help Move it down again, that helps. Ooh, 100, 100 accumulators. Yeah. By moving it down again. Press the wrong buttons. So the pipe goes like that. Now the underground pipe goes there, there, and there. It's going to be another option for water. So I now have water passed here and easily accessible. This I want to be cracking. No, I really didn't need to do this. Let's build another pump. Yeah, pump would have probably done better. Just 
get another offshore pump. Save all this. Save all this difficulty. So we go. Where are they? The offshore pump. Because the difficulty comes with the cracking. So when you've done it. New petroleum gas. So I did need this. Fantastic. It was all planned. <laughs> anyway. Let's grab some more things. We don't need any smart inserters. What's missing in the construction box? Probably something is damaged. Okay, something's getting damaged. Nine turrets have engaged the enemy. I think something is damaged in this area. What's damaged? Basically, what it's saying. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I know. I've got another turret here. Wow, I'm actually out of turrets. Where's my construction robots at? Yeah. Someone's coming out with a repair kit and it's going to repair stuff. I mean, let's figure out this piping system anyway. New offshore pump. Then pipe the ground. So have we used them all? No, no, there they are. And one. Let's get a little bit more. 
piped grounds here. Then I've got lubricant, lubricant, cracking. You're going to be making sulfur. Where's that pump? And be emptying the storage tanks. It took a little bit longer than anticipated, I must say. I'm waiting for oh batteries. I forgot I actually don't have batteries automated in moving over here, do I? The chests belt down. The furnace. It's a long arm inserter. Request of chests in. I request batteries. Um, probably need 10 because how many does it need? Yeah, only one battery. Request batteries 10. Logistics robots. So we've only got the one logistics thing. Build it there. Put in those and half my repair kits. I've got a I've got any passive? I do have a passive. There you go. So the logistics robots are now gonna go pick up the batteries from the provider chest and move them to the requester chests. Just like that. And because they've only got, they can only carry one battery at a time at the moment. Look at that. Excellent. I've actually sorted that out. <laughs> but now I'm now having to use logistics robots to do it. Mm, guess I don't need to. I've got any cogs around. I do. Gears can get another logistics robot. So 
that's all working nicely there. There's an accumulator storage doing. It's surviving, I guess. anymore. Okay, so that's that done. Is updating my solar power. Put work out nice grid which uh, joins together. There's a blueprint for it. Still. Let's build three there. Accumulators. Side like that, you see. And then where is my power poles? Poles there are giving a lot more power. It would really help if we got some stations. But I'll have to do that next episode. So I'm quite happy with how my defences are working. Could always do with more laser turrets. I might actually make an automated laser turret facility. But I now have logistics robots working as logistics, which is awesome. So thank you very much for watching this episode of Factorio. I am in a different, and I shall see you next time, where hopefully I might even be able to get some personal robots, which will be really cool. But we'll find out next time. But until then, I'm out.